Uh, anyways, what's up guys? It is white out here, and as I promised you, I am doing some Battlefield 3. I'm bringing a variety to my channel, because I know that all my subscribers are not here just to see COD. Call of Duty is not the only game in the world. Battlefield 3 is still here. Battlefield 3 is not dead just because Modern Warfare 3 released. Now, uh, <laughs> I've been seeing a lot of crap all over YouTube. Um, before Modern Warfare 3 released, when Battlefield came out, there was a lot of people hating on Battlefield 3. And they were saying a lot of bullshit, like, you know, Modern Warfare 3 is gonna beat, blow, uh, Battlefield 3 out of the water. Battlefield 3 is shit, it's garbage, it's crap. Modern Warfare 3 is gonna be the best game of the year. Yada, 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 so on and so forth. But, uh, I've been seeing a completely different story ever since Battlefield Battlefield 3 and Modern Warfare 3 have been both out. Uh, when Modern Warfare 3 released, I am seeing a lot of hate, and I mean a lot of hate towards Modern Warfare 3. For some reason, a lot of people are not liking Modern Warfare 3. They're not liking the uh, the outcome of the development of the game, what what it came to be, and how it's set up, and how it how it plays. Um, when transitioning from you know Black Ops to to uh, Modern Warfare 3, it's a little bit of a transition because Black Ops, uh, to be honest, Black Ops was not as fast paced as Modern Warfare 3. Modern Warfare 3 has got a lot faster pace. Ooh, double. Eh. Uh, Modern Warfare 3 has got a lot faster uh, pace than uh, Black Ops had, and people are not liking that. I, uh, you know, I don't know. My opinion in this, in this whole fucking thing, is that. Modern Warfare 3 and Battlefield 3 are great games. And I will continue to post both Modern Warfare 3 and Battlefield 3 and Modern Warfare 2 and everything else in the genre. First person shooter games. I love first person shooter games and I always will. Um, this whole thing with people hating on Modern Warfare 3 now, it just makes no sense to me. And all I can say is I told you so. There were so many people hating on Battlefield 3, but I told them as soon as Modern Warfare 3 comes out, they're going to say the same exact thing about Modern Warfare 3 as they are about Battlefield 3. And all I can say, like I said, is I told you so. Uh, I, I, myself, I don't understand all the hate, but it doesn't matter to me because they can hate all they want. Haters are going to hate. And lovers are gonna love. I'm a lover, okay? I love Battlefield 3. I love Modern Warfare 3. In my opinion, they're both great games, as I said before. And that's not, no, nothing's gonna change my mind. I have come to love both of these games. And um, hopefully the next COD will be just as good, because it's not that I'm a COD fanboy or I'm a Battlefield fanboy. I'm both, alright? I'm gonna come out and say it right now. I am a COD fanboy. I am a Battlefield fanboy. What you gonna do? Come on. Seriously, I play these games. I've been playing Call of Duty since Call of Duty Classic, the first Call of Duty. I've been playing that since day one. Um, I've been playing Battlefield. Battlefield is a little bit newer of a game for me because the Battlefield series I started on uh, Bad Company, the first Bad Company, and uh, I never played the first Battlefield game, Battlefield uh, Modern. Uh, Modern Combat, I think it was. <clears throat> but uh, Battlefield is is a great game. Uh, it's it's fun to me. I have it's a change from Call of Duty. If I get sick of playing Call of Duty for a little while, I hop on some Battlefield 3, get a little bit slower paced game going on, and have some fun. There's a lot of changes. Battlefield 3 is more realistic than COD. That's my change. That's what I like about it. And Call of Duty is a little more fast paced and that is another thing I like about Call of Duty. The fast pace is a great thing because I love to run a gun. I love to be that gunner flying around the map and just tearing shit up, tearing people apart. Um, sitting in corners is not my thing. Sitting and waiting for the enemy is not my thing. I love running and gunning. I'm, I'm a rusher type of guy. In, in Call of Duty I rush. I rush, rush, rush. Um, sometimes I snipe. Sometimes I don't. 
Uh, sniping in Call of Duty is extremely different than Battlefield 3. Battlefield 3 and Battlefield genre, they there's a bullet drop. There's it, you know it's just com completely different. There's no quick scoping in Battlefield. Modern Warfare 3, there is quick scoping. There's no bullet drop. It's extremely different for between the two games. So, you know, and I'm not saying that that's a bad thing. There's differences in both games. We all love Call of Duty. Well, I can't say we all love Call of Duty. But all of us Call of Duty players love Call of Duty. We've loved Call of Duty since it came out. That is why it's one of the biggest franchise, video game franchise out there. And I just got fucking spawn killed. Uh, <laughs> that is why it's one of the biggest game franchise out there. And uh, that is why it's the top seller. Battlefield 3 is right up there with Call of Duty. But anyway guys, this game is about to come to an end. So uh, yeah, you know, keep an open mind. Just <clears throat> play Modern Warfare 3 a little more before you decide to make a decision on what you hate. I have not had a problem with that game. I'm actually been loving that game, but you know what it is. People like people got to hate, people got to love, you know, it doesn't matter. But anyway, guys, that's the end of the game. This has been a Battlefield 3 commentary with Whiteout HDX. So please rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll be back with some more video games. Peace.